A thrilling opening game in the Euroleague season between Ceska Moscow and Lietuvos Ritas Vilnius. Arturas Yomantas pushed the Lithuanian up by two in the fourth quarter, then Renaldas Sebutis and Leon Radosevic built a four points lead for the guest. Tony Wims gave the lead to Ceska with five points in a row. Sebutis missed the winning shot at the buzzer. Zalgiris Kaunas welcomed newcomer Zedevita Zagreb in front of a sellout crowd that was recompensed with a red hot Paulus Jankunas. Popovic got the home team in control in the middle of the second quarter with 11 points in a row and kept the host way ahead with a 17 point margin. Zedevita could not find a way to come back and Zalgiris ran the clock down with some spectacular plays. A great third quarter by Brad Oleson and Maciej Lampe allowed Caja Laboral to return into the game leading by one after Olympiakos ended the first half up by 11. In the last quarter the jumpers of Stratos per Peroglu, then Kai Lines in the paint and at last Pero Antic gave the first seasonal win to the reigning champions. Elan Shalom hosted Seiko Prokom Dinia in Turkish High Lions Euroleague debut. It was a balanced game until the start of the third quarter when Steve Chikandu and Sheldon Williams drove Shalom to a plus 14. The Polish champion tried to come back in the fourth period but fell short, so it was time to celebrate for the guys at Greg Bunio. Fenerbahce Hulka Istanbul scored a 17-6 run with an impressive effort by Elio Prelcic to lead by 10 at the half time for the 6-36. Zoran Kralinic for Hulki started with 5 points in a row in the third, but the home crowd was delighted with the exciting effort of the Turkish squad that built a 16 points lead in the final quarter behind the efforts of Nekale, Bonano and Sato. Nakoro Cantu also the Union Olympia Ljubljana. The Slovenians led by six in the third quarter with a great contribution by Sasu Salin, but the home team came back thanks to Pietro Aradori, who tied the score in the final period. Ljubljana closed the game with a long range shot by Dylan Page, Clement Krepelic, and Salin again. Unicaja Malaga could not complete a comeback. They were trailing by 15 points and tied the game to 63 with Earl Calloway at the end of the third period. The Devo Ayon netted the two crucial key pointers for the guests and Maccabi took a 10 points lead, 75-65. Logan and Hitman combining for 30 points and they were decisive in the last minute to secure Maccabi Electra's success.